Hello, hello, yeah, yeah, make a video, yeah, 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 YouTube. Today while I'm making this, it is April 8th, Thursday, April 8th, 2010, and I haven't made a video in for reels like a really long time. I've been super busy with college, you know, since I'm a double major. The classes are pretty, pretty crazy. Um, hanging out with friends and Easter and spring break, blah, 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 all that fun stuff. So, nom, nom. <laughs> I'm back. And I think I'm going to start doing this as like a daily thing where I just talk in front of the camera and funny stuff every once in a while with my friends. So, I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, ahem, ahem, ahem. The weather has been really ridiculous. Like, last week, it was like 85 one day. Regardless of the exact degrees, there were, it was like consistently, oh fuck, consistently warm for like a week and then this week starts and it's rainy and gloomy and not only is it rainy and gloomy it's cold it's super cold and I'm just uh, it puts me in a gloomy mood especially after getting a taste of sunlight shout out time I would like to say hi to my friend Steve-O P. <laughs> um, he makes really funny videos, so go to his channel. Um, his username, Steve-O P. One word, Steve-O P. I went to see The Runaways, like exactly like a week ago, and wow, I loved it. Anyone who knows about The Runaways, the movie or the band, if you've seen it, let me know what you think. In my opinion, I thought Joan Jett and Dakota Fanning did a really, really good job, so I thoroughly enjoyed it, especially because I'm a huge Joan Jett fan. Um, it was a little weird seeing Dakota Fanning play Cherie Curry. There was a scene where, I don't know if you know anything about Cherie Curry, but she was a huge drug addict at one point in her life, and they had in the movie have her do a bunch of drugs and she had to act high like most of the movie and she like snorts coke and that was just weird because when I see Dakota Fanning I don't think of her as how old she is now. I don't think about the fact that she grew up. I think about the fact that I used to watch her in movies like Uptown Girls, Hide and Seek and you know like she was a little kid and it's just weird. It was weird, especially when Kristen Stewart and Dakota Fanning had to, like, hook up, basically. They, it, was, it was strange to see that, but it, I thought it was a really well-done movie. Yes, ask me a question on Formspring. I'll put the link somewhere around here, and you click on it, and you ask me a bunch of questions. Alright? Alright. See you later, YouTube.